<laughs> Come on, Eric. Daddy! What? Come on, guys. Uh, my name is Sergeant David Andrew Irvin. I'm here to go introduce myself to my kids. I've been away 18 months, and uh, we're going to surprise them today. They have no idea that we're gonna, I'm going to be doing this, so it's going to be really exciting. So how do you feel on your 21st birthday? Another day in paradise. Yeah? yeah. I got you a present. Oh yeah? Yeah. Okay. You want me to get it? Please. Okay. Okay, do I come with you? Do I come with you? You can come with me. Okay, try not It's not a new car, just so you know. Yeah, that's well, fine. I like my car. I like having a beater. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Happy birthday! I'm 
Boys and girls, direct your attention to the area in front of the Tin Caps dugout for a special presentation. Thank you, Jared. All right, we have some special guests here. I am here with the Conrad family. Now, back July 14th, uh, each game we post some of our Facebook and Twitter posts up on up onto the video board. And one of those posts on July 14th was from overseas, a very long way away. We had Sergeant Nick Conrad. He sent us a post all the way over from the Middle East saying that he was still a Tin Caps fan over there. So who we've got here, we've got Nick's family here, okay? We wanted to bring them out. We heard that they were here around town, so I wanted to introduce you to them real quick. First up, we've got his mom, Kelly, his dad, Steve, his brother, Chris, along with his niece, Addison, down there, and then his sister, Sarah, on the end here. Now, he's been deployed for almost a year, his second tour of duty with the U.S. Army. And now, Mom, when do you guys expect him back home? Hopefully for his birthday next month. This, on the 19th. On the 19th of, of September. Okay. So you're expecting him home very soon here. Are you guys excited to see him? So very excited. All right. Well, I think, uh, I think there's somebody here to see you right now. That doesn't give you goosebumps, not sure if you're alive. Sergeant Nick Conrad, from the F Company 3, 238th Aviation out of Franklin, Indiana, has been back stateside in more than a year. Returning from Kuwait, he's also served in Iraq, a graduate of Leo High School. For the homecoming here at Parkview Field. It's because men like that that we're able to have this in front of us tonight. God bless them and God bless the United States of America and the armed forces, the men and women that are keeping us safe every single day, every single moment of our of the year. And that's I mean, and what people at home didn't see the whole entire stadium was actually on their feet clapping both dugouts were on their on their feet clapping the players on the field were on the field clapping for that young man and that's um that's saying so much of what what our men and women 
taking up arms to defend our country and keep us safe and keep our freedom alive. That's what it's all about. Lucky here at Parkview Field to get to witness a lot of incredible things. Many of them fantastic athletic accomplishments on the field, but nothing comes even close to comparing to what we just saw right there. This has been a Tin Caps production. But I'd like to especially recognize Deborah Cooper. Deborah didn't know this. Deborah, I want you to know that we really appreciate your your service as a veteran. She's a perfect example of this ongoing educational opportunity because her daughter, Staff Sergeant Makita James, is act is an active duty in Af Afghanistan right now. Actually, she's not in active duty in Afghanistan right now because Staff Sergeant James has just returned from Afghanistan to be with her mother. what it's all about. Oh my God. I'm not sure Deborah's gonna be able to make it through the ceremonies. Oh my God. I just want to